Hey, this is Marvin Stemmel of the Blue Poets, and welcome to another episode of Guitar Junkie, and I hope you're all doing marvelously well. Today I have the pleasure to play two of my favorite guitars, 163, uh, 263 Stratocasters, and I'm going to play it on a simple blues and B flat, run everything to a 65 Bandmaster, and after about uh, 90 seconds into the performance, I will change miraculously guitars and pants and um, tell you the exact signal chain, amplifiers, pickups, pedals, etc. after the performance. So, enjoy, comment, subscribe. Yeah! <laughs> So this has been my main guitar for the last 12 years or so and it has been through the war as you can see it. Some of the parts were refinished with Tipex when I got it. So that's where no finish is left at all. It has two beautiful, uh, three beautiful holes for additional tuners in the headstock which was common practice in the early 70s in Indonesian restaurants here in Europe. So this guitar it's not exactly easy to play. It has a very uncomfortable neck, it doesn't stay in tune and it hums. Uh, and it's probably one of the best sounding guitars I ever own. It does have a very very comfortable neck as opposed to the white one. It's a B neck, refretted with 6105's. Uh, it's a refin and uh, these pickups are original. This one is a Blue Poet signature pickup by Klopman. Uh, the original one died 
a couple of years ago. I call this one Red Eye because there were two switches in the pickguard for, uh, for out of face switching or whatever. So I didn't fix it very beautifully, but I left some of the character. So that's Red Eye, and the other one is Head Hole. So, this is the amplifier that's being used. It's a 65 Bandmaster modded by the great late Niels Thomsen. Uh, it has an extra gain stage, but I didn't use it. So, I used the stock version of the amplifier and turned down the additional rectifier tube. Uh, what I did though is turn up the amplifier all the way to 10. Here, volume 9, master 7. Middle two and a half, bass three. Oh, sorry, middle on seven, treble is on ten. So it's really, really loud. Uh, the amp has been boosted once again with the elephant uh, plug, uh, but just this time as a clean boost. I just used, uh, you know, the volume, no gain at all. Uh, so it's basically the secret of this sound. If you want to achieve something similar, is just volume. And it's power amp distortion. Uh, the amplifier once again is going to my 4x12 cabinet. Then it's mic'd with the Tull G12. And then it goes to my API preamp and from there into the DP4 reverb. And I also use some additional TC electronics delay stuff. And that's it. So I hope you enjoyed this little episode of Guitar Junkie. Catch me every Thursday. This was Marcus Demmel. Peace.